Okay, shall we look at this gym and see how things have changed today? You see, there's so much history here. It's been a few weeks since we had a great melt. It was warm, and so we had the stream flood and froze over on the top, and then as the water level went down, it left that air and ice. It created ice as it fell. That was from a flash freeze. So that's still there. It's kind of hard to see the edge of the stream. Now how do you know where the edge is? Part of it is knowing the stream. See in the middle we've got some grass. Those are islands now. And it's only because I know that that's not surface that under that tree that I wouldn't go under there now, but it used to be it was it was surface. See, there's new ice forming at the bottom. We've always hollowed this area out and put the stones further away to make a bit of a deeper pool there for the kids to play in. You see now the, the water does come back here. See where there's no grass? I would not stand there where there's no grass. Although I don't think it's all the way there. I don't think the stream comes all the way out to the edge, but I don't think it's safe. Sometimes the grass at the edge is growing out of the side of the bank. Sometimes the trees are growing out of the side. See when they're curved like that? That makes me wonder. Okay, I'm gonna go back up here and put on my snowshoes and walk across the marsh. It's really more of a meadow than a marsh. It was a marsh when the beavers flooded it, but it's not flooded anymore. Okay, bye.